What's going on miners? Chump Change XD here. Hope you're all staying healthy, having a great day. As you can see, this is my crypto mining grow tent. And right here we have my meter boxes. I am going to be swapping all of these out with the actual branded meter box that is a higher grade quality. It just makes me feel a lot better. And on top of that, it's gonna be completely uniform. So don't forget, you guys uh, were affiliated this month with the meter box. So if you want to get these, grab them now, you'll be entered to win an eight GPU server case. But if you guys wanna see these all installed, let's do it. All right, so first things first, this box right here, it's pretty cool. He actually stamps all the boxes for uh, the month of March, which is awesome. Um, the reason I'm gonna be swapping these though, if you look at these boxes I have installed previously, they have the screw tabs on the sides. Those are the Space Goats meter boxes, as well as uh, Red Llama Crypto actually made me this one. So thank you to him for that. These don't have the tabs. This is why I like this box because I'm gonna put a two by four right here along the rail and I'm actually gonna mount it like this. So I can actually just side mount it through the holes in the side there. That way I can visually see every meter and I don't have to like look at it sideways, if that makes sense. I mean, not like it's a big deal, but I think it would look a lot better if it was like this. So that's what I'm gonna do. First things first, I gotta shut down all the breakers. I gotta kill all the mining rigs, which is really awful. So. Grow tent's working pretty fantastic. This rig I just shut down because it's getting a little hot and I'll explain why in another video, so stay tuned for that. But uh, yeah, let me get all of this shut down. We have to kill all these breakers and I'm just gonna slap this together real fast, so let's do it. So I literally just shut everything down. Look at how dark this grow tent is and it's super quiet now that I have those fans off and I actually have the one going into the furnace off as well. So now I need to remove all these meter boxes here. If you guys haven't seen my how to wire a meter box video, please go check it out. I'll leave a link above. I'm just gonna speed through throwing these things in. We're gonna mount them, like I said, facing this way so I could look at them all and we're gonna see how nice it looks. So let's do it. Look at that. All said and done. That's the 30 amp and then I have two 20 amps right below that. The only thing I can suggest is you really want to get some sort of fitting to fit in this hole. That's the only thing I couldn't do. A push connector just wouldn't fit the normal ones I have. So I'd have to find a different size. But look at this, guys. I am so happy that I am trading these out for the meter boxes. Like, look at that plastic just melted away at this meter box. So this is obviously, you know, PLA, and this is a lot softer than this kind of plastic. So I'm assuming the grade and quality is going to be a lot better, and I'm not gonna have to worry about this with these boxes. That should be uh, pretty nice. Obviously, you're doing this at your own risk, but that this is scary. This could have been real bad. So now we gotta turn everything back on because all my stuff's off. As you guys know, I already have the breaker on. As you can see, all the 240 volt outlets are wired and working at 240 volts. All right, so I just threw all the quick lock connectors in. These are like you push in and you twist them to lock them in. Now I gotta turn on these fans right here. These are the grow tent fans that I just have them temporarily wired right there. So those are running out. All the rigs are on except for this one. It shut off on purpose. Again, I'll show you guys that in a later video. I do need to turn this one back on. So this one's going to my house. This is the one that actually feeds directly into my ductwork. If you haven't seen the Grow 10 video, go check it out. So give me a second, let me turn all these back on. All right, everything is back up and running, mining away. Let's see what we got. Looking right here, we have 5,500 watts basically on the 30 amp. We have just under 4,000, 3,800 on this one and 3,600 on this one. So I can't stress enough to make sure you guys are safe when you're doing electrical and all that. Uh, obviously I do my own, but you guys should hire a licensed professional to take care of this. But I'm super happy with the quality of these boxes. So what'd you guys think? This is more of a temporary setup for me. I'm going to be putting these in a better location at a later date. But if you guys want, don't forget, this is the last day for you guys to purchase these meter boxes and be entered to win that ATPU server case. It is literally a full mining rig minus the GPUs. That's pretty sweet. Again, we have a 10% discount code. It is chump. I will leave it down in the pinned comment as well as the description. You guys can go to the referral link and get entered to win. You also get double the entries 
when you purchase the green meter box so that's that but guys as always i appreciate each and every single one of you for watching go down here hit this like button don't forget to subscribe and if you haven't seen this video or this video please go check them out and i'll see you guys soon peace